day two of vanilla latte, grilled cheese, water, and ham and cheese croissant. It is not organic. But it's good. So we're powered by that every morning. I feel like today is just an extension of yesterday. Like that's literally how this is feeling right now. I don't want it to be an extension of yesterday. No, meaning Absolutely like not. not the bowling, but it just feels like we took a little nap and woke up, which basically is what happened, but it felt like a 20 minute nap and yeah. I don't know what you want me to say. Tell us a joke. Uh, my bowling yesterday. <laughs> I was gonna say Nate Garcia, so that was pretty close. Yeah, we're on the same page. It's <laughs> a funny joke I've heard all year. The good news from today is that it is a beautiful day outside. The bad news is that I was given the keys to the car so I can enjoy the beautiful weather outside before they start. And um, I put them in a safe place and then couldn't find them for about 30 minutes. But the good news in that is I found them and now we can go watch Nate Bowl. Welcome to my life. Yeah.
Well, heading into lunch for the first six games today. It's hard because obviously it's easy to sit back and say certain things being a spectator and say, oh, you could you could do this, you could do that. But um, I can't sit here and say that I would feel any other way as I'm sure Nate's feeling right now if I was in the same position knowing I still have 24 more games or 30 more games, sorry. Knowing that you haven't quite matched up or your spares haven't been the best after starting off hot and then having not a great look. Um, I'm sure I'd be feeling defeated as well. I don't think this is anything to hang our heads about. It's not like we're going 200 under every block. I hope that Nate can take these last 30 games and just realize that regardless of what happens, it's a learning experience and that there's always another year and that this tournament doesn't define his timeline and what his potential goals are if he still wants this to be a goal in Bowling Tour that just because it's not happening exactly the way he planned it this time even though this isn't over but that he can take this and learn for next year especially if they do the same format that he's still young and again everyone's timeline is not the same so he doesn't have to put those expectations on himself and he can 100% still reach the goals he wants if he just takes this and learns from it going forward. Hey right, y'all, for this block, me and Nate came up with a new game plan. We only took nine balls to the lanes and I'm like, let's just simplify it. And we're gonna talk through every single shot together and see if we can put together a better block than his last three six game blocks with us thoroughly going through every single shot together. And let's see if we can make a run. It's not over until it's over. What are we saying to Blair Wood? Wherever the hell we are. What? Where? What are we saying to Blair Woodridge? Peace. <laughs> 
Yeah, we're gonna stop right there. I love you. Love you too. <laughs>